It is Lagos Talks 91.3 and the time is 27 minutes past the hour of one. It is still the dish. Yes, your fun talk show with your ladies. I'm here with Faith History and Bookie Caribbean White and trust me there's a lot to, to dish about today and honestly but before that we have someone in the studio like i said to you earlier when sadiq was here we said that there'll be someone coming to the studio today and she goes by the name of omotola jala de ekende well, good, well, afternoon. Well, well. <laughs> good afternoon the, like, can you can you no 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 no, no because no, no, you see, no, no, we're, we're yeah, so yeah, starstruck yeah. oh you're still starstruck yeah we're, we're okay. so, so plus, starstruck plus i'm gonna have to do hmm. like a special sound effect for you oh, oh, okay so you got me i can do that i can go i can go again go again all right so presenting to you the Award-winning actress and philanthropist, Omotola Jalade Ekende. Da, 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 da! Oh, <laughs> that's it. Also known as Omotola Sexy. Omotola Sexy. Stop it. That's her. Right Thank here. Thank you. I appreciate it. That was almost 007. <laughs> <laughs> almost. But, but you know what? I'm actually starstruck. This is my first time of meeting you. So Me too. Hello. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Like and head. you know what's I so like shocking? You, you never know how energy. amazing and how easy to talk to she is until you finally meet her. <laughs> yeah, but you know we, what I mean? we, we hear reports and she's a diva. I thought I thought she was gonna come in here oh, really? and say everybody stand up. I was like, oh gosh, I'm so Girl, scared. Why are you still sitting there? Why are you still sitting there? You see me twerking with her at Book the door. tell them. <laughs> <laughs> and tell them. She had Bookie over here, you know, dancing. <laughs> Nicely. Okay. She's my girl. All right, yeah. so she's here to talk about, you know, the One Campaign and also the, um, uh, the Poverty is Sexist campaign. Yes. So please tell us, first off, before we get into the One Campaign and the Poverty is Sexist campaign, mm -hmm. It was the International Women's Day yesterday. Yeah. What does that mean to you? Um, it means everything. First and foremost, I'm a woman. Mm. Um, I can't daughters. escape that if I, even if I wanted to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stuck in womanhood. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. It suits you. <laughs> you know, so I can't speak for anything more than what I know. And um, having lived my whole life as a woman, I understand exactly what our struggles are. Um, they don't necessarily have to be my experiences, but what I see around me with other women as well. And so for us to have a, a, a day dedicated to, to women, it is not only Im important, it is very, very vital, you know. And I think that every person, apart from Jesus Christ, was born by a woman. Mm -hmm. ah, Jesus Christ was born by a woman. What am I saying? Even Jesus. Was I was thinking about Jesus. He wasn't born oh, by a man. He wasn't just born by a man. He was born by oh. a woman. Oh. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> so that's, that's how important women are. And even God has demonstrated that to us. Um, so there's no there's no human being who would say I don't understand the essence of a woman, and if women are um, that important to your life, they've bettered you, they've nurtured you, and everything. How much more um, so many other things in life that they have done, you know, in helping you to grow, in you know, taking care of your needs and all of that. Why would you not want to see those women being paid back? First and foremost, in respect yeah. and in 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 um, in any love. other way love you know and all why would you even want to hurt one of them and so mm. to have a day where we can actually talk about these issues is is dynamic yes. amazing it's awesome and you're beautiful. also the mother of girls right yes, I, mm. do have two I mean you're beautiful so, have two daughters, daughters, yeah. so that's you know because I, I think it, it's different when you when you when you now birth a woman and you're mm. like oh my goodness oh my goodness she's she's now in the world and i have to protect her and, and i have, I have to, to think about you know. things that probably i didn't even think about for myself yes mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because now you don't want her to go through all those things mm -hmm. whether they're restrictions or whatever right um but anyway all right so you know there's been you know much talk about women empowerment globally yeah now but from your point of view you know do you think things are getting better for the nigerian woman or the Nigerian woman. Mm. I actually think yes. Um, in the past, what, three years or thereabout, we've, we've been more aware. I think the awareness. I agree. Um, now we talk about cancer, yep. you know, um, awareness for women. We talk about uh, cervical, you know, cancer. We talk mm, about breast screen. cancer. Yes. Mm. These are things that we never used to talk about. That's true. I'm starting about, you know, from the health issues. Mm. Um, then now when it comes to domestic violence, mm. more than ever in the past few years, now you have women coming out and saying, look, I've gone through this. Mm. And, you know, I wear my scars mm. and I can tell my story. Mm. So um, helping other women who have been hiding to understand that, look, you're not the only one. Right. And there's nothing shameful about this. You, mm. you weren't the one who did the crime. Right. Someone mm. else did the crime. You don't have to, you know, be the one 
to be ashamed carrying the shame yeah for yourself, someone else's you know? crime you know and yeah. you have other women who have even some very notable women who have gone through this mm -hmm. so it's not peculiar to you mm -hmm. it's not because you're not beautiful enough it's not because you're not strong enough or mm -hmm. you're too stubborn or you're too stubborn or anything mm -hmm. it's, it's just something that happens That's you it. know so and these are these are you know progress rates that we have mm -hmm. uh, recorded in the past few years mm -hmm. so with all um confidence i know that it is improving it's, it's, yeah it's, for the nigerian woman and you're very right because issues were like that were meant to be kept a complete secret mm -hmm. even your parents you will tell you don't talk about, about it yeah, exactly yeah. you weren't allowed to speak about it but now people are um, speaking more people are speaking out or more women are speaking out and more women are a bit more Vocal. confident and, 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 and confident yeah and, and, and going by uh, uh sorry to just quickly button uh going by our uh, hashtag which is be bold for change okay. mm -hmm. you know i think nigeria has been bold for change mm -hmm. yeah, for a bit so yeah. The world is catching up with us. Yes, yes. And, and we're using those hashtags every day. And here mm. on The Dish, we talk about these issues all the time. Mm -hmm. and, I'm, and I'm sure some of our male listeners are like, ah, these women, are they just like trying to be so hardcore feminists? It's not because we're hardcore feminists. It's just the time is here. Mm -hmm. And we're all going to use our voices. You mm -hmm. know? So you've used your voice mm -hmm. uh, you know, for the One campaign. Mm -hmm. How did you get involved? And what is the One campaign? Like, what is... The, what are they about? Yeah. What are they about? So the one campaign is by um, well, uh, a partner is um, Bono, who you guys all yes. know. Um, mm -hmm. There's another um, demand, someone else in the background. Um, but um, basically, the one campaign has so many other campaigns. But mm -hmm. I work with them on poverty is sexist, mm -hmm. and I've heard a lot of people ask what uh, poverty is sexist means because it sounds very controversial. Mm -hmm. But what what they're saying is the face of poverty is a woman. Period. Wow. It's period. It's just as simple as that. In and Nigeria or worldwide? Worldwide. worldwide. When oh, anything also. happens, you know, like mm -hmm. war and stuff, mm -hmm. who are the people that actually bear the immediate brunt? It's the women. Mm -hmm. Because if it affects sure. children, the women are the ones who mm -hmm. end up, you know, um, taking care of the children. Yeah, and then uh, being emotionally, you know, really, yes. really scarred. Even, mm -hmm. even exactly. if it's the man, exactly. When the man goes to one, everything, if he dies, he's dead, he's gone. He doesn't mm -hmm. feel any pain. Who remains to. to Take to care cry of over to him. cry over him and take care of what he left behind, mm -hmm. the woman. And if she is in a very terrible country or the system or whatever, now whatever he had never even comes, doesn't her. come back to her. Right, mm -hmm. right. Then she's you know so. However you look at it, from whatever shape, you know, country, culture, whatever, the woman eventually always still bears. Uh, the bronze and we're saying that if you can lift women out of poverty um, mm. we're not saying they're going to be better than the world we're not saying they're mm. going to be better than men we're saying that they're going to help mm -hmm. and they're going to better you know whatever situation it could have been because is that too much to ask because it's historical it's because you see one thing i feel like people feel to realize is that the children are the future mm. right, right? Mm. the woman must be well equipped to raise a child the children mm -hmm. or raise a child because mm. then that's shaping what the future looks like exactly. and she stays that's why there's longer a lot of with the emphasis child. on mm -hmm. the girl child and stuff like that because she's going to grow up she's going to be a mom and have to shape the thought process and what the future is going to be very like. right so there's a lot of emphasis on women i get it mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Most definitely. Mm -hmm. So that's what one campaign is, um, right. to, be, to be precise, Poverty is Sexist is about. All right, so that's Poverty is Sexist, which is part of the one campaign. Mm -hmm. And now you have a new campaign called Girls Count campaign. What's that about? Is that a campaign? It's not or really a campaign. It's part of the the Poverty is Sexist campaign. Sexist. It's just yeah. what we are concentrating on at this at time, time. Okay, which so is education. Under it. Okay. Yeah, yeah so which is education. And because I got, I, got, I got a WhatsApp message on it, and I'm very proud to say that I counted. I counted to one... 1,908. Yes, okay. so my picture is on there. So, yeah, so, so let me tell mean? you what it is. So basically, they were talking about how many... She's just hired. Kids. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> how many kids are out of school? Especially oh. female mm. kids. Girl, girl, girl children mm. are out of school. A lot of them are not in school and XYZ. So they feel like they want to create... I think it was a movie It's, it's pretty much... Yeah. It, that's it's going to last forever or whatever. Mm -hmm. But anyway... You're meant to count and choose a number when you stop so counting. 130 million. Yes. Oh, wow. Okay, Which so is the amount of children, that girls that are out of school. Exactly. Exactly. Everybody's supposed to yeah, add pick a your number name. And just pick a number. Yes, yeah. So at the end of the day, it's supposed to be collated and then you know, presented mm -hmm. to leaders, to world leaders, and say, look, can you afford to have this amount of... Mm -hmm. you know, but It's yeah, pretty much girl. like you counting and signing. You know, it's just like the signatures or anything, but mm -hmm. this is more... This is like what... Um, visual or something, yeah, you know. Yeah. And so you add your voice to that and we'll say this amount of people recognize this is going on. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do you? Wow. And, you know, and, stuff. And what was your number? 
1908. I chose that because that is the year my sorority was founded. Okay. Aww. Okay. Which you're know, wearing Bookie, that, Bookie that and dress her sorority. Today. Exactly. <laughs> She's wearing that top. AKA. AKA. <laughs> Don't play. Okay, so that's about 130 million girls out of school, mm -hmm. apparently. So, you know, what kind of steps do you use this number? Well, they're doing something already, which is the girl count, you know. Mm. Um, but they're not asking anyone to come, you know, donate money or whatever. That One campaign is not really about that. Mm -hmm. And Poverty's Exodus is not about that. What what they really want is advocacy, mm. yes. uh, you know. And so they want everyone to be involved in that way. Put your voice, lend your voice, put your signature, yes. whatever it is. But come together, be aware of what's going on. You know what's amazing and unique about one, though? Mm -hmm. Is that they target policy cha ch changes, Change, you know what I'm yeah. saying? They... Mm -hmm. they, they they target the government through the voices of people. Okay. I really, really, yeah. really enjoy what they do. It's mm -hmm. not unrealistic. Exactly. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. They're targeting that top, that once that change is made there, it'll I trickle down and make sense. Instead of asking you to come to the streets and yeah. come and, you know, no, no, just, no, yeah, no, so we're just using social media, yeah. we're using the right. internet. You know, it's yeah. just another, makes you know, sense. it's very really brilliant, really a very brilliant strategy. Yeah. 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 You know, so you see all these people, you know, counting and then you see these numbers rising and we're saying, look, exactly. this amount of people are on this matter. Yeah. You know, so is it not important to you enough yes. that all these people, all the citizens, all these people that you're leading, right. you know, very, very care about effective. this subject. Yes, yes. you know yes. that is what effective. it is. And to be and to be um, specific, what they're asking for, what they're asking for is that all 36 states and the federal capital territory mm -hmm. Abuja, should publish their annual education budget, mm. right, as Fantastic. well as submit costed mm. budgets in order to receive, you know, matching grants from UBEC. Mm -hmm. So, you know, this is important. Like, it just is. publish your budget for education. Can we see it? Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Because transparency is a major problem. Like it is very, yeah. yeah. Nobody, Especially in Africa. Yeah, nobody gets to see, you know, what they're spending You hear on about it, you know, you'll, the day they announce But you'll it know what it. they're sharing for, you know, uh, mm -hmm. code and things. Mm -hmm. You know, so, <laughs> this is important. Mm -hmm. This is important stuff. It is. All right, so, you know what, as we are wrapping up right now, how can we be a part of this if anyone is listening right now? How can they join in on Please this? Please go to want.org and pick a number. <laughs> it's just right, simple. It doesn't cost you anything pick other than number. that. Have yeah. you picked a number? My number is number seven. Why? <laughs> <laughs> it's a number very, very special to me. Most of our names in my family end in our seven letters. Plus, I was born 7th of February, so... Yay. Oh, yeah. Seven, is, seven, yeah, seven is a very special number for me. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. Did you plan the name thing with the seven no, letters? Funny enough, no. I mean, we just realized one day, we're like, oh my God, I'm also, I'm, 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 like, we just went like that. All right, so before you leave, you know, to all the women listening out there, is there any message you have for them? Um, to women, of, I'll, I'll first say first to Nigerian women. Um, I, I want to say the days where you were afraid, you know, those days are over. Mm. Um, these are the days of being bold and confident and going out to achieve everything that God has made you and, you know, um, created it to be. Mm. Um, the message is not for women to be wayward. The message is not for women to be, um, because, you know, we have to balance this thing. Yeah, aggressive. You know, yeah, not mm -hmm. aggressive. And then, yo, they say we can now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yo, now. Yeah. 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 Radio today. Oh, rather, <laughs> rather be assertive. That's right. not the be message. Assertive. But the, mes mm. the message here is that, you know, um, don't be a coward. Don't be afraid. Don't, mm. don't hide yourself. Mm. Um, you are just, you are just as important as whoever was born with you, mm. men, men or women in your family. Yes, yes. Um, know that you're not alone. We are fighting for you, with you, with and you. alongside you. Mm -hmm. um, I also want to tell other women to be more supportive of women. Yes. Um, it is that's very important. shameful sometimes when you see men actually yes. standing up for us yes. Yes. more than we are standing yes. up for yes. ourselves. So, yes. We need to be less judgmental of ourselves. Mm. Yes. And it also, have, after saying that, we need to also behave ourselves. Mm. Because it's, it's not enough for us to say, oh, you know, do this for women. Women, we need to do that. And we're what not are talking we to ourselves. ourselves? Yes. We also need to talk to ourselves yes. women when you get the opportunity when we support you and you get the opportunity to get into government please do not disgrace us exactly. don't go and steal money and exactly. shame us exactly. because we don't have too many of that yeah. slot yeah. and so don't be the bad egg that would you know draw that us ruin back everything for us you know, and, everything. Ruin everything. and all of that and women should also denounce such people mm -hmm. and let them know that we do not support them mm -hmm. and, all that, and push the good ones we need to yes. push women it's because true. the more we push women the more our, our daughters have opportunities and the more we can affect and, and more we can affect laws for yes. our own good Good. Yeah. We've been trying to pass whatever in, in the house, you know, for how, how long. Yeah. It's not passing no. because we don't have enough women. We don't have we enough, don't have enough strong women. Yeah. Right. You know, so when you find a strong woman, push her. Yeah. Mm. 
Yeah. She might just be that house girl. Yeah. Don't mm. maltreat her. Mm. Don't maltreat you know, her. give her confidence. So every woman, every girl is important. There's a there's a girl that was being beaten to death behind my house, my and I had to stand up for her. Mm. She's not my maid. I could have just turned my eyes away and said it's not my business, mm. but I stood up for her because she's going to be somebody's mother tomorrow. Mm. And because she's being maltreated that way, she will think it's okay. Exactly. And she wants to maltreat somebody else's, else's child, child tomorrow. So please, when you see a girl or a girl child being maltreated or not being treated nicely, mm -hmm. don't just look away and say, I don't know her. Mm -hmm. Remember that it will come back and bite you some way. It's a small yes. world. This world is getting smaller and smaller yes. by the minute. Yes. Support yes. a woman today and you're a hero. Yes. Oh, beautiful. Hey, well, all right. And, and with such passion, you know, that's what I love about Which is why she's the perfect person it. for this campaign, though. Yes. Following she her success it. with her it. career mm -hmm. and her personal branding. I'm mm. sorry, I'm always speaking from a PR standpoint. She's just a PR guru. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't think of anybody better than her, you know? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Gracias. Yes. Fabulous. More kudos to so you. So please go to one.org and go pick a number. Yeah. Yeah. Pick, pick we a need number. you to pick a number. Mm. A number. Mm. A number. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so so much, Matala, for coming into the dish. You I actually had fun. Us. Yes, yeah. it's, a, it's, yeah. a, it's always fun with the I ladies. will come back. I yes. definitely Please will come back. Come back. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe next time you come, you come dish with us. We'll be scooping, sourcing, orishi rishi, ati pomo, my lord, ati ewe do, all of this. You know you eat with me. She will eat. Okay, likes gossip. I know.